Hey everyone, Mr. Sujano here. In today's video, we're going over which version of Dolphin on Android is the best. Let's get started. All right, to kick things off, Dolphin has a bunch of different versions available on Android. We have the main build right on the Google Play Store. There are development builds out there, and there's a plethora of forks out there. For example, MMJ, MMJR, MMJR2, the old one, MMJR2, the new one, Dolphin 360, and a bunch of others. One of the biggest questions I get about Dolphin is which version to use. Now the answer to that question isn't necessarily as simple and straightforward as you might think. I can't just say, hey, use this version, it's gonna be no problem whatsoever. And that's because we have to factor in a few different things here. First and foremost, there are a bunch of different versions of Android out there. And there's also a bunch of different phones out there. We have different CPUs, different GPUs, different phones will handle the emulator differently. And secondly here, what are you trying to go for for your experience? Are you looking for emulation accuracy? Or are you looking for something that maybe has taken a few shortcuts just to get a game up and running and you don't really care about emulation accuracy, you just wanna play at more than five frames a second. So instead of me saying which version of Dolphin is the best, I do recommend following this process. And if you follow it, chances are you'll find out what version works for you. The first version I recommend checking out is right on the Google Play Store. This is the official release of Dolphin, and it's the one I recommend going to first. Once you've tried out the main version of Dolphin, if you're having game-specific issues, I do recommend checking out dolphin-emu.org slash compat. I'll leave a link in the description below. They've listed here pretty much every game for the Wii and GameCube, and if you click on one here, it will let you know if there are any issues, and maybe it's fixed by a setting. Maybe it's fixed by nothing, but it will let you know if it's a game-specific issue. Now, if you're running into issues that are more than just that specific game, or if this specific game is having issues that aren't listed on the compatibility page, you can check out an updated version of Dolphin, and that's right on the download page on the official website. From here, you can check out the beta version, which the latest one listed at the time of filming is 5.0-15993. That is one version newer that's currently showing on the Google Play Store. Now, in the event that the latest beta version here matches what's on the Google Play Store, or if you've tried it out and it's still not helping, then scroll down here to the development versions and check out the latest one. These development versions are really on the cutting edge. Sometimes they'll fix an issue, sometimes they'll introduce another issue, and sometimes they'll break things altogether. On top of that, they're updated multiple times a day, so you might get your fix here and you might not. Now, once you've exhausted every single official option, this is where I'd recommend checking out a fork. Forks I always find are a last resort. Sometimes they can be great and other times they can, well, they can introduce a lot of issues. If you're looking for performance or if you're looking for accuracy, there are a bunch of different forks out there and they offer a bunch of different features. If you're looking for pure performance, I recommend checking out Dolphin MMJR. MMJ stands for subscribe to Mr. Sujano and R stands for revamp. This one is based off of Dolphin MMJ, which was a fork in itself designed for performance. Your emulation accuracy might take a bit of a hit. You might be introduced to a bunch of different bugs using this, but it also might get you a little bit better performance. In addition to MMJR, you can check out MMJR2. MMJR2 is a little bit different here. This one is based off the official build of Dolphin as opposed to MMJ. This one might not perform as fast or it might be faster depending on your device. Now to make matters a little bit more confusing with Dolphin MMJR2, there are two different versions of it, one by Lumens and one by Bankai Master. Bankai Master is the original creator of Dolphin MMJR2 and Lumens here has picked up the code because Bankai Master will probably no longer be updating it. And again, these are free, so feel free to try out one or the other and see which one works best for you. Last up here is Dolphin 360, which is based off of Dolphin MMJR. So it's a fork of a fork of a fork. You can try this one out. I don't know if it's still in active development, but if you're absolutely desperate here, well, it might be for you. Now, I'm not showing any gameplay in this video, but if you really want to see gameplay for some reason, I've done a video in the past and I'll leave it in the description below. In that video, I played Dolphin beside Dolphin MMJR, Dolphin MMJR2, the old one, and Dolphin MMJR2, the new one. But realistically here, performance is gonna vary from device to device. Performance will vary depending on what version of Android you're running on. There are a bunch of different factors here. At the end of the day here, hopefully you can see now why it's not necessarily a simple answer to say what version of Dolphin will be best for you. But my advice fortunately is very simple. 
Always use the official version of Dolphin first, whether it's on the Play Store or directly from their website. Once you've exhausted those options, then maybe check out a fork. Anyways, that is all I've got for you. Short, sweet, and to the point, all stuff and no fluff. Let me know your thoughts about pretty much anything we talked about today, which was Dolphin and some forks. So do you like Dolphin? Do you use Dolphin? And what version of Dolphin do you use? Let me know in the comments below. If you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't like this video, leave a like. Hit that subscribe button, check out my other videos. Don't tempt fate, save your state.